Hello everybody! So, today I got this hot dog roller. Um, I just looked it up and normally it costs about $1,200 and I got it for free. So, I'm now, um, I just went by Costco and got some hot dog buns and some hot dogs and, uh, oh, there we go, and some hot dogs. Uh, and so, I'm now uh, headed home in a huge hurry. To, uh, to test it out and see if it works. So today I got a hot dog Ferris wheel and I'm super excited about it. It's right there. I haven't even plugged it in yet. So, I mean, this could be the most anti-climatic video ever. Um, let's see. All right, I'll get a nice little selfie with it. And the light turns on. All right, we got the temperature gauge. There we go, you can see, you can see it spinning. All right, let's get some hot dogs in there. All right, so I've got my hot dogs now, and we're just gonna put those in, and let's see if this makes good hot dogs. I'm not sure if y'all could see that hot dog juice that just squirted everywhere. I personally am very excited about this. I'm gonna turn up the heat a bit. I think the, maybe not. All right, we've got some hot dogs on there. I don't know how long to leave them on though. I guess we'll find out. I did. I looked it up and it's usually like a thousand two hundred dollars. Yeah. If it's the right model. But uh but yeah, you do you have dinner plans? I do not. I mean now I do. Yes, now you do that's a good answer. I don't know how yeah, long yes. to leave them on though. But you can probably just tell by looking at them. I don't know. But I kept on blowing this outlet. I've plugged it in so many times. And so it's also missing one of the bulbs. Like I think this bulb is actually the one that does most of the heating. Cause I feel like the glass would reflect the heat versus this one just kind of all shoots out. Mm, yeah. I don't know. Oh, well now I feel dumb. The light bulb isn't what produces the heat. There's little heat things. Kind of like a toaster oven has, like heat coils. Right. For some reason I was thinking, you know, this was like a heat lamp that just slowly heats them up. I have no idea how long to leave it. Best purchase. Well, not even a purchase. It was free. Who gave this to you? I guess you could say finders keepers. <laughs> Seth, did you go dumpster diving again? <laughs> I mean, hey, they should have had a fence around it. They should have put a <laughs> lock on the fence if they didn't want people going in their dumpster. <laughs> I don't think. Oh, that does warm up. Dude, this is like the coolest machine ever. Yeah. Hello, everybody. So it has been about 15, 20 minutes, and I'm here with Thomas, the the uh, the great. And uh, and so these hot dogs, they are getting pretty hot and they're pretty good. I found out that there is this bun compartment. I think it's supposed to have a sheet, but it doesn't. So let's see here. All right. Oh, I just covered the camera, but oh well. You know what? We're gonna go with it. 
All right, here we go. The first hot dog with the hot dog machine. Thomas, would you like to do the honors? I would love to. It's partly because I didn't clean it and I'm scared to eat it for myself. Is it cooked all the way through? Is it a good hot dog? 10 out of 10, would recommend. You would or would not? Would recommend. Would recommend, okay, cool. Are you gonna get sick from the germs that are in it? I'll get back to you on that. <laughs> All right. It seems all right. Hey, at least it's not COVID. All right. Now, that's true. Maybe that's why they threw it away. <laughs> that's a pretty good hot dog. That is pretty good. This is definitely, for things, I mean, it lives up to its name. I didn't even see its name. I mean, it doesn't snap, but it's named Delicious Hot Dogs. But, um, anyways, so there's today's adventure. Um, let's see, Thomas, any, any final words? Totally gotta put you on the spot. Stay fresh. Stay fresh. He says as he eats an hot dog. He says as he eats a hot dog. Got the wrap.